Across the Air Force, we're starting to see a restructure of organizations. Previously, in a lot of the maintenance groups, we had an aircraft maintenance squadron or AMXS, which is what a lot of people are used to. And then within the past couple of months, USAFE in particular has started adjusting into what are called generation squadrons. So depending on the mission set, you're either going to see a fighter generation squadron for our F-16 counterparts or our rescue generation squadron for our helicopter unit. Uh, what this is essentially doing is it's taken the one organization and broken it into three independent squadrons that are going to now pair directly to their respective operational flying squadron. So we still fall under the maintenance group as a whole, but we are now better able to have a decentralized focused unit in order to support the flying squadrons that we're associated with and have that better focus of our mission, combat operations, and aircraft generation, as well as uh, be able to deploy and operate with with our operational counterparts. What's in a name, right? Rescue Generation Squadron. So what the name does is it allows us to focus on what it is that we do. And in line kind of with what brought about this change, the combat oriented maintenance organization, this is uh, in line, what shouldn't be new to anybody, Agile Combat Employment Ace, and I know we've all been talking about it, especially on Aviano. What it allows is for a consolidation and a concentration of those things that are the building blocks for a maintenance organization so that we can focus on generating the combat air power that our associated operational squadron requires to accomplish our mission.